These are the undertakings that will occur to the Toad Naga when I find them. They will discover there are things far worse than death. My name is Zaktan, and I am the leader of the Paraka. Not days ago, my companions and I came to the desolate rock known as Voya Nui. Uh, companions, do not just say that word. More like expendable fools. Hakan, Thok, Vizak, Radak, Avak, and I took control of the island by enslaving the population of Matorin in search of the Kanoiak Naika, the mask of life, an item of extraordinary and unlimited power. However, our great arrival to gain ultimate power was interrupted by a group of Matorin and two teams of Toa. The first team, the Toa Nuva, were defeated with Is, but the second, the Toa Ignaika, were a different force entirely. They fought us across Voyanui, to the very chamber of the Mask of Life. However, unknown to all of us, Vizan was already there. He arrived on Voyanui before we did, and became a guardian for the Mask. It fused to the back of his head. After negotiations failed, we fought and lost against the madman. The Toa Ignaika arrived and defeated him, surprisingly of all. The Toa, known as Matoro, retrieved it from Vizan. It seemed that the mask wanted Matoro to grab it, to hold it, and possibly use it when next we meet Toa of Ice. I shall find out what makes you so special. The Toa's victory did not last for long, as the Kanoe Ignaka seemed to have a life of its own, and flown from the Toa's grasp, away from all up from whence we came into the ocean surrounding the island. Outnumbered against Axon, the Matoran, and two Toa teams, I decided it would be best to wait in the shadows until the mask revealed itself once again. And I would claim it for myself. But things didn't go as planned. Back when we searched for the mask and that cursed volcano, I and the others fell into some kind of mutagen. Its effects lingered, but we paid no heed. However, when we entered the cord beneath the surface, I and my fellow Paraka were transformed into... into something even the Shadowed One would cringe at the sight of. We lost our weapons, our limbs, our legs, our entire body seemed to have faded away. What was left of us became floating heads with spines. I had truly become a snake. <sighs> Note to self, I truly hate the word, floating. <sighs> now we travel through the tunnels of rock and crystal, waiting to run, or now swim into our foes once again. destroyed the spear, Radak. It could have restored me and kept from looking like this. You gonna keep on about that? Were you preferred I snapped you instead? Shut up, you two brackus monkeys. Hey, there's noises up ahead. Nasty noises by the sound of it. Zyglak. I hate Zyglak. Let's go around. These guys love the taste of Skakti. You are no fuck. <laughs> Silence! No. We will use these creatures as a distraction. We will kill them. And we will wait. We will wait for the Toa to return. How are you so sure the Toa will return? 
Oh, great leader. Because, Hakan, you imbecile. I know Toa. They will return to the surface with the Mars Victorious. And when they do, we will kill them and claim it for ourselves. With the Kanoe Ignica, I will rule this universe unopposed. You mean us. Right. Us. So now we will wait for our heroes to return. Their victory will spell their own destruction. Their weakness is their blindness in doing what is necessary to win. To steal. To punish. To kill. They will never see us coming until it's too late. That is why we are Paraka. Oh, and you are the